Offshore fixed platforms are permanent structures for oil and gas production, which are protected from water corrosion by the installation of galvanic anodes. Thousands of them in the world are reaching or have exceeded their original design life. Consumption affects anodes until complete depletion at end of design life, when only the steel insert remains. Thus, cathodic protection is one of the issues to be managed and retrofit is required to extend the service life of existing structures. Tensioned Anode String System, TSA system, is one of the most versatile and effective solutions for cathodic protection retrofit in offshore platforms. The TSA is tensioned between anchor points on sea floor, clamps or dead weights, and on lower deck of the platform with a dynamometer and can be installed inside or outside the jacket. The TSA system consists of mixed metal oxide activated titanium LIDA anodes assembled on a mechanical supporting rope. The production process of TSA provides that a steel rope is tensioned, laying horizontally, anode spacers are placed in determined positions along the rope, and a LIDA string is winded around the rope. A heat sinkable sleeve is applied on cables. The whole strings is presented covered by PE tape, with the exception of the anodes that are bare. A protection box is applied on anodes to protect them during transportation. The so produced string is winded inside a wooden box, and it is now ready for shipment. Once arrived at the platform, the installation process begins. The pad eye is weld in the design position and elevation. Dynamometer and turnbuckle are connected. The dead weight and the box containing the TSA are available on a supply vessel moored close to the platform. The lower end of the TSA is connected to the dead weight. Then a supply crane rope is connected to the dead weight by an ROV operable shackle. By the platform crane, the dead weight is moved outboard the barge in correspondence of the vertical of the target position on sea floor. Using the crane, the dead weight is lowered along the vertical descent route with the TSA connected. The dead weight TSA system is lowered until the dead weight reaches the sea floor. The winch rope is moved to the barge and connected to the upper terminal of the TSA. Using the winch, the load is applied step by step to the TSA and the turnbuckle, open, is operated, closed, to recover the right length of the TSA under tensioning. The operation is repeated up to reach the target load. The diver installs the TSA stainless steel protectors in correspondence of the splash zone. The LIDA cable bundle is moved to the positive junction box and protective tube installed. The TSA is completely applied on the jacket, meaning that the whole structure is now protected. No underprotection could be found in any single element of the platform. The protection conditions are uniform. The TSA system provides significant advantages. Excellent distribution of the protection conditions. Competitive installation costs. Compactness of the system. Low risk of mechanical damage caused by anchors or falling weights. High reliability of the components. Full separation of the electrical anode circuit from mechanical support components. No electrical interference side effects.